up this is Anup and welcome to another video from Noyo Motorcycle Series and in this video I'm going to explain you everything you need to know about CBS and before getting into this video if you are new to my channel do consider subscribing and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you don't miss any updates from my channel so CBS basically stands for combi braking system or combined braking system this uh, uh, thing was uh, basically started by the Honda this is a patent technology from the Honda two wheelers and started way back in 1990s I guess but in India it was launched around eight or nine years back uh, in Honda two wheelers and started with Activa I guess in CBS when you apply the rear brake uh, the braking pressure is uh, equally distributed on uh, both the uh, brakes that is front and rear okay whereas when you apply only the front brake the braking pressure is uh, applied only in the front tire now if you're an experienced rider or if you uh, know riding very well you must uh, be knowing that uh, the best way to stop a bike is to apply both the brakes in in a ratio in which bike stops safely and thus uh, reduces the stopping distance as well so keeping this in mind uh, honda introduced cbs that is common braking system now uh, how does it work so when you apply the rear brake there is an equalizer uh, which uh, distributes the braking pressure on uh, both the tire based on the hydraulic pull. I'm not going to get into detail but understand that there is something known as equalizer which adjusts the position of the hydraulic valve so that the braking pressure is applied on both the tire that is both the brake actually front and rear alright so how do you identify whether the bike has CBS or not alright so let's take an example here I have a Honda Hornet now if you see the front uh, disc of the bike you see there are two wires or two pipes which goes to the disc rotor whereas if you see the Suzuki Jixxer SF this doesn't have CBS and you see there is only one wire which goes to the front uh, disc rotor right so how does it matter I mean why why do we have a two wire for CBS and only one wire for non CBS so before getting into detail I'll suggest you guys to uh, watch my video where I've explained how the disc brake works then it will be easier for you to understand how you know uh, CBS works actually uh, but nevertheless I'll just give you an gist so when you apply the front lever the this coil flows from this pipe that is one of the pipe and it pushes a piston against this rotor and that's how your bike stops so this basically works on the hydraulic principle and uh, this is how your bike comes to stop okay now in CBS you have two wires uh, again both does the same thing but in this one of the uh, wire is for the front brake that is when you apply the front brake lever the entire pressure is on the front wheel and that is to one of the pipe whereas when you apply the rear brake only the 40 percent of the hydraulic pressure is applied to the uh, front wheel and that is through the other pipe that's the reason why you have two pipe or two uh, wire you can say in CBS all right so that's uh, pretty much in this video guys I hope this video was informative I'll be bringing such videos uh, every now and then on my channel so stay tuned and uh, if you like the video do give a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below if you have any suggestions or questions with that being said thank you for watching be safe at least wear a helmet while adding and do not drink and ride I'll see you soon in my next video take care bye bye